Savages is like, like the thug of indigenous people. Like, that's what they just call them to justify <laughs> killing them. That's like a slur almost. I apologize for saying that. Oh, no, nah, they savages, bro. Who did that? I didn't, I didn't know. Like I said, the first one was here. The second one was like right here. This one is, it, it, it. let's see, let's see. We only an hour in, let's see though. All right, I don't think I have, I don't even have any of my gear. All right. What's that beeping? Now, one thing I will give Laura, though, you could drop this girl in the middle of the Sahara Desert with a bottle of with a bottle of gasoline and nothing to drink, and she gonna she gonna find a way to survive, if nothing else. She is she is she is the ultimate survivalist. I would have just sat in the plane until somebody came and saved me. Like, Where are they? she didn't hesitate. She got them. up, started picking berries, cutting down trees. Like, <laughs> she got right to it. Like, mm, been here before. She is in the middle. Of, what is this? The Amazon forest? The Ama is it forest or jungle? Closer. Amazon jungle? Someone's over there. I have to get to them. Me, I would have been right in that plane. Like, where is the Red Cross when you need them? Damn. Swaggy. Fire. Someone must be around. Hello? Jonah. Miguel. Can you hear me? Where okay, our fir our first campfire. So this was traditionally where we level up and and all that good stuff um where we usually take a break between chapters and all that hit so hard so this is all my fault i should have listened to jonah thought it through and yeah, so, so you can say that, that in your own head but you can't no one else was hurt no the village destroyed let me let her get her thoughts out i need out. to stop these cataclysms before it's too late like so you, and that's the other thing i'd never understand about people like so you can say that in your head you can admit that well you know what admitting it to yourself is the first step so i'll give her credit there admitting things to yourself is always the first step but it's like damn your friend would love to know that 
part of the plane landed here. My gear is in that cargo. I'll need to cut it down. Might be a sharp piece of scrap in that section of the wreck. It's puzzle time. She has been in this forest for like seven minutes. Already has a weapon. Already got Something's food. Something's still holding the supplies up. This girl's different, man. She's different. She's built different. <laughs> Why is the camera zoomed in on me like that? Yes. Now I can get my gear back. Once again, what does she do? Let me take care of me first. I mean, sometimes you got to take care of yourself first before you can go help your friends. But like Jonah is probably upside down in a tree getting jumped by howlers right now. She's like, yo, let me make sure I got my bow. Miss Croft? Anyone? Come in. Miguel? Oh, Where Miguel survived? Didn't... Didn't Miguel get his, like, whole face blown off? Or was I tripping? Maybe he just got knocked out. I could have swore Miguel was dead. Like, wasn't he in the front of the plane too? Miguel? I don't like this. Miguel? Where are you? That boy Miguel got his booty took. He got snatched Miguel? up. Miguel? What are there like savages living in the Let me not call them savage savages. Are there like indigenous car um carnivores? With knowing this game. Oh no, that ain't no carnivore. <laughs> or maybe Miguel did this. Maybe Miguel did this. Savages is like, like the thug of indigenous Miguel? people. Like, that's what they just call them to justify <laughs> killing them. That's like a slur almost. I apologize for saying that. Oh, no, nah, they savages, bro. Who did that? Oh, it's okay. I'm over here. Yeah, Laura, you might not be built for this one. <laughs> you might not be built for this one. Then again, we did fight a bear in the last game, so... Oh, that's gap. There's two? Oh, yeah, nah, it's up. It's up for this girl. And they got home court advantage. Holy shit. Jaguar territory. That was, I'm assuming that was Miguel. God. Yeah, they hunt, they hunting, they're hunting me. Got to be careful here. What do you say in the first game? You see me in a fight with a bear, pray for the bear. You see me in a fight with two jaguars, pray for me, please. Cause this is a lot. Look at them just stalking me like animals are so like they're so superior to us in so many ways like uh, uh. That's 
Yeah, yeah, what's up? Okay, they going, they going, they going. And look at the howlers just watching like it's pay-per-view. Like, look at them up there. Like, oh! Mm. Mm. I'm a dog, bro. I'm a dog. I'm a dog. Y'all gonna have to work for this. Y'all gonna have to earn this kill. What's up? Can you see what I did to your mans? Oh, good move. Good move, good move, good move. I didn't think he had bounce like that. How many shots to the face does it take? Gotta be wounded now. Oh, they double team and they jumping, bro. Yup, yup. You hear that? You hear that? You hear that? It's the sound of. That's the sound of. I don't know. Oh, he didn't like that. He didn't like that. He didn't like that. Laura. There's no way. He didn't like it, but he respected it. He didn't like it, but he respected it. He respected it. So is he, does he like eat? Does he eat the other one or does she eat the other one? That was probably her man and she was like, oh, he was a bum ass. Anyways, I'm so glad you got rid of him for me, girl. I'm gonna let you slide. He didn't pay no bills. He didn't take care of no kids. He ain't bringing no, no food, no kill. So now I'm gonna feed him to the kids and I'm gonna go find me a new one. Mm-hmm. That's probably, that's what she said. I literally heard every word she said. She about to go call on Tyrone. What is wrong with me? <laughs> okay, so I was collecting all of those because those are health. All right. Copy, copy, copy. I was about to say, there's no way, like, they tried to do some Jurassic Park shit where it was like the Jaguar didn't see her. Like, you know how acute their vision is to be hunting in this jungle? Not to mention their smell, like that was that was a respect thing. That had nothing to do with whether or not she should have been killed. Why are you so chill, bro? He probably poisonous. Let me leave him alone. That frog, the way that frog just squared up with me, look at how they square up with me. Bro, what's what you trying to get into? What you trying to get into? What's up? I didn't like how he was squaring up with me, bro. So this is the side of the plane that Jonah was Jonah, in. Jonah, are you there? Once again, before she even does a 180 to see if Jonah's there, her good old faithful axe. I thought I got you killed. Hey, do you know what happened to Miguel? Yo, listen, Jonah. I'm sorry, bro. Another one of your mans just What's got wrong killed. With your arm? Ah, some sort of parasite. I was looking for some wormwood, but it doesn't grow around here. Let me see. <laughs> what are you doing? If we leave it in there, it'll only get worse. Sit. Hey, if nothing else, Laura know how to survive, bruh. 
sure you know what you're doing? Uh, <laughs> I had something similar happen to me when I was a child in Egypt. I won't lie, it's gonna hurt. You think that storm from earlier was the storm? The one from the mural? I don't know. Uh, uh, I think maybe we should stop and take stock. We've been pushing so hard forward. <laughs> Flying into that storm. I didn't think it was gonna be that bad. I... Well, I should have insisted we turn back. I mean, I get it. You lock onto a problem and everything else just disappears. <laughs> Jonah. I, I... I'm with you. It's my choice. Ownership, Most accountability. But if we die... Who stops the cataclysms? And look at him. He thought about what she one. said. And he's actually acknowledging her. Let's see if she does it in return. Sometimes I feel like I have to keep going. And if I don't, then I'll just let everyone down. But maybe for the sake of a few hours, we could have turned back. Not a direct apology, but we'll take it. That's <laughs> growth. <laughs> Maybe we should give him a name. Okay. Eli? No, my cousin. He's always trying to get under my skin. <laughs> Goodbye, Eli. Parasites. Ugh. It's just crazy how, like... I'll talk about it after. I'll talk about it after. I was about Thanks. to go on a tangent. We should go. If we can find Kowakyaku, we can rest for the night. Sounds good. It's just crazy how, like, as human beings, like, even though we, we, we've overpopulated the earth, like, the when I was saying earlier, like, how animals are, like, when I was saying earlier, like, about, like, how animals and wild animals are, like, the su superior, our superior species, it's because they don't, they don't, they've, they've learned how to master their environment. Humans, we, we, we adapt, but we, we destroy to adapt. Like, like a jaguar, you drop them in the, they're dropped in the jungle. And in that hub, they've conquered and mastered that world. Like how to hunt, how to survive, all that stuff. And they don't need to leave that bubble spread out more and, adapt to new environments like that I, I i so maybe that's not superiority but that's like that's what makes animals like so unique humans we have to expand because we overpopulate and then we have to adapt and by adapting we destroy and rebuild but it's like crazy how even in that like we still don't have the ability to like freely travel without modern medicine like me as somebody who's lived in America my entire life, if I wanted to go to South America, if I wanted to go to Africa, if I wanted to go to even Asia or like Australia, like I have to go to the doctor, I have to get shots, like I have to do all these things to make sure my body doesn't get sick just by like traveling, like even with traveling being like something that can be done within like i can go to the other side of the world within 24 hours which is absolutely insane but i still have to use modern medicine to even survive there for a week so you drop me in the forest yeah i might have all these survival skills but my body is just gonna get sick the second i drink water or the second i eat something because i'm used to cook food i'm used to process food all these different things like i'm just gonna die from diarrhea in like a week you know what i'm saying like which is a terrible, painful death. Like, it's just, it's just crazy to me. Like, as much as we think we adapt and we, we're superior, it's because of like technology. That's the only reason we're we're even able to do it. You drop us in the woods, butt naked, on a different continent. I'm glad you're gonna die. We're it. like, I would die from itchy butt crack in a week. TMI. All right. Yeah, Never I mind. I think Miguel was heading toward it when. How'd you manage to get Eli in your arm anyway? Uh, I was trying to figure out if the water was clean. Got my answer. <laughs> See? He got that parasite just from checking if the water was clean. 
I wouldn't last a day. I believe that if it is true, it's important enough to die for, or for Trinity to kill for. So this is really about revenge? No, no. I, when I took the key, I also felt a power pulling me towards something. It's real. If you felt a power pulling you when you took the key, is it in your head now? No, it left me when Dominguez took the key. If it's that strong, how can you be sure? Let's just find Kwakiaku, okay? Okay. Okay, upgrading weapons requires necessary parts, resources, skills, from inventory, select the weapon. Which, though, wouldn't you rather be somewhere warm and dry with a beer, maybe a friendly stranger to flirt with? <laughs> yeah, I would. Like, you can't imagine. Okay, so but here's upgrades, all this stuff. System's a little different, but pretty similar. All right, here we go. We got some outfits, though. We got some outfits. Bro, what? Why is this 8-bit Laura in the game? What is, what is, what is this? What is this? All right, so tangents aside, we got Jonah back. We can get through here. Let's see what's next. But once again, this game, if this game had like Last of Us 2 level combat, ooh wee, this would be absolute gas, bro. It's, it's fire so far, but yeah, no problem, bro. Um, it would be absolutely gas. It must be Kwakiaku. We have to get down there. You sure this is a path? Come on, stay close to me. This is definitely not a path. <sighs> but it's nice to see that Jonah and Laura kind of cleared the air a little bit, the best way that they could. Almost there. Heard that before. Sometimes a near-death experience will do that. Oh, oh gotcha. You. You're right. I'm okay. Just a couple more steps. Okay. Okay. You're right. I, I, I'm okay. I'm okay. Could have been the Inca. They knew a lot about hydraulics. The bridge is down. Maybe we can lift it through those kind of ways. Maybe. Okay, so it sounds like we got another puzzle coming up. I probably should have put the puzzles on easy just for the this sake works. of the playthrough, but <laughs> you wanna try it? Uh, Whatever. When it comes down here, maybe I can I can grab it and attach them, and it'll pull up the other side. Yeah, that's what it is. It'll pull it up. There we go. Okay, Jonah, you can let go. Let's, let's get across. Let me find out Jonah got got hops too. He kind of cle he cleared that pretty easy. Guess we go through here. After you. What's that? I think it's some sort of stealer or. Help me with this. Sure. What is it? It's a recipe. Seems to be a mixture of herbs. Could help if we run into any more jaguars. Let's hope we don't. The way out is over here. Hmm, so hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold then tap to use a perception herbal mixture. Allows Lara to sense animals and natural resources throughout the environment. So it's just like an enhancer. We're getting closer to the village. 
Usually this game, they'll introduce a lot of hunting mechanics, but you don't usually need to like really apply them. It's not really like Far Cry where, you know, it adds, it behooves you to actually go out and hunt and things like that. I think we can get out that way. Jonah, help me with this. On three, two... One. Oh, it came back. Bro, bro. <laughs> Her entire spine would have been in the Amazon River right now. Bro. Yeah, it came back because it realized it wasn't the independent jaguar that it thought it was, and it needed it needed the additional income. I thought we had a mutual respect, bro. I thought we had a mutual respect. Now I'm locked in. Now I'm locked in. What's up? Now I'm locked in. What's up? Now I'm locked in. What's up? Yeah. Now I'm locked in. Nah, matter of fact, nah, I'm hunting you. Where are you at? I'm hunting you. Where'd he go? I'm hunting you. Oh, give me those. Yeah, what's up? What's up? I see you, bro. What's up? I'm hunting you now. Yeah. 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 Yeah, you should have went back to your cubs. You should have went back to your cubs. I didn't want to do this. Now, somebody explain to me why Laura still has a back. What is she made out of? Are you okay? Help me with this. Look at her back. Look at her back. It's like nothing happened. I mean, nah, she tore up. She is torn up. But she's just a dog. She's just acting like nothing happened. I'm gonna go make camp. You sure you don't want to clean up those wounds? Yeah, because there's no way that junk does not hurt, bro. There's no way. It's not pretty. <sighs> you know, with everything we've been through recently, I've been thinking about my brother. I always try to protect him from my father. From himself. But I lost him. You did everything you could. If I had been in the right place, the right time, he would still be here. If I had eyes in the back of my head. You can't protect everyone. Oh, so that's why Joan is so protective of Laura. He's like a sister. Or like the brother that he lost. <laughs> Thank you. Joan is a protector and Laura is an avenger. I miss him. I know. My parents. I miss them too. I had a dream about my mother recently. Yeah? Mm-hmm. It was so vivid. 
<laughs> when I was little, my father used to keep things from me. Hide things. About her, especially. Why would he do that? After she died, he thought they'd cause me pain. It didn't stop me from looking for them, of course. <laughs> So many questions. Your dad created as many mysteries as he solved. Dominguez said that he would use the silver box of his shell to remake the world. If you had that power, what would you do? <laughs> Panic, probably. You wouldn't go back to when your brother was alive and be with him again. Um, and lose everything else. No way. I like this world. It's it's not perfect, but everything I love now is in it. Mm -hmm. she just smiled him like i know that was a touching moment but he's trying to be he's trying what he's trying to say is like laura i don't know what i don't know if there ever is or ever will be anything between us but whether it's just like as somebody as a friend or as more than that i love you and i love protecting you and i love having you around me and she hit him with the with a with a smile to and kept the pushing. Treasure, the adventurer Lara Croft must outwit the king. Reach she said, "I don't got time for love, Jonah." Solve the mystery of the you white wildin. queen. The way be fraught with trials. Lara, are you doing your best homework? The adventurer should not dally any longer. In a minute, Dad. Oh shoot, we playing as. Baby Laura? The high walls of the castle beckon, taunting. This is this is how she grew up. And you are out here listen. She out here being a mass murderer. And this is how she grew up. Looks like there's something up there in the crow's nest. The floor gives way! Lara tumbles into the darkness. What crow's nest? Oh. <laughs> Lara climbs out over a lake of bubbling lava. <laughs> One thing about this girl, she got imagination, that's for sure. <laughs> now for the real treasure in the forbidden tomb. Our hero must be quiet to avoid alerting the king. Let me find out Laura is using her privilege. Her dad. She hasn't much time. Let me find out Laura is using her privilege to live out her childhood imagination and she's dealing with the trauma of losing her parents that way. The king's garden. All she needed some therapy and a boyfriend. This is some nut shit for a kid, bro. Look at how high up she is. I don't know, I was never this adventurous as a kid. Our hero spies another entrance. Like imagine coming outside and you see your kid on the side of the house like this. And then the worst part with kids is once they get caught, then they want to freeze up. And now you got to call fire department to get them down. Where if you just leave them alone, they going to find out how to get to where they're going. The extraordinary height and danger and pushes it from her mind. 
You are 40 feet off the ground. Ah! You saw that look on her face, it just got real. Now she now she understands the danger she's put herself in. Yo, look at what this kid is doing, bro. I would have a heart attack. It's like, as a parent, would you want your kid to be an adventurer like this or sit in their room and play video games all day? Watch her At fall. Last. I bet you she gonna fall. She spots a way in below. She will have to be careful. Why do I do these stupid things? Shit! Yep. God. Tearing up the whole side of the house. Oh, chuckles at her audacity. <laughs> She's close now. How are you gonna explain that to the insurance company? At last, she enters the forbidden tomb. Wow. Like, look at this is a literally they have a field house in in <laughs> as a room like what does Lara's dad do by night the great bat stole the queen at 30 north and 90 east from her pen she wrote her heart with light unlock her love's release i wonder if the white queen is lonely is this a puzzle it is. Find the White Queen. I have no clue what I'm doing right now. That's the White Queen right there. So we have to put the two knights here and here. I have no clue what I'm doing. So what I'm, my theory right now is based off of this picture, right? The two, no, they got to go on the inside. So that means you need to get, you, y'all need to, y'all crusty dudes need to get out of here. Y'all crusty dudes need to get out of, uh, right up out the way. So I can get everybody else to where they need to be. This is the part I don't understand. The coordinates like. might have something to do with the globe. What coordinates, girl? What what coordinates are she talking about? Oh, on the okay, 30 north, 90 east. 30 north, 90 east. 30 north, 90 east. This globe is fire. With light unlock her love's release it worked that's all i had to do this whole time <sighs> uh, croft has entered the forbidden mezzanine she'll have to be careful these artifacts are this is insane for your just to have in your house this is millions of dollars worth of stolen history yeah 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 y'all heard me 
all this stuff is stolen. And it's stolen because it's not where it was left at. This looks Mayan. Is it animal skulls? And omen? I haven't seen some of these Can't discover something before. if somebody Osuary. left it there. This box contains the bones of the dead. I can't read the inscription. Great bat swings and fur. <gasps> the knight's shield reflects the lightning. There she is! The White Queen. Trapped. I have to help her. So, what I do? Just change the coordinates? With light, unlock her love's release. Amazing. Imagine having to do that and like the only thing that was in here was like a bathroom. Her heart pounding, our hero crosses the Or this was probably like her dad's like sex unknown. dungeon and that's how he hid it. All that was Even foreplay was for when he brings his dates over. Wonder she got a wild imagination. Tell me about this. You and me are riding a T Rex in Egypt. Where's Daddy? At work. Daddy wasn't there to take her to the fair to change her underwear. Daddy wasn't there. She gets it from her dad. So you wrap uh, this explains why th everything about this explains why she is the way she is That's trauma And then she finds her dead dad They made it look like it was a suicide Yeah, the Lara Laura suffering from like <laughs> serious trauma 